it's Marianne. Let's make some beef tostadas for dinner tonight. My kids love these because they get to make their own, you know, assemble them however they want. And they're a lot of fun. They're easy to make and they're also really, really good. So let's make these, okay? Let's start with the tostada, okay? These come in packages like this in the supermarket and they really are just a deep fried corn tortilla, okay, like this. So if you would like to just make your own at home, that's great too. You know, buy your own corn tortillas and just deep fry them in hot oil. Now these, they cook really fast. So if you're going to do that, be very careful. I mean, a few minutes and you're done, okay? Otherwise they'll burn. So either way, if you do decide to, to fry them at home, make sure that you drain them on paper towels so you get the excess oil out, okay? So let's make our little salsa here. Okay, I have a medium chopped yellow onion here, okay? I'm gonna add a 14 and a half ounce can of, uh, of peeled and diced tomatoes to this, okay? To this I'm gonna add two garlic cloves, which I minced. I'm gonna add a jalapeno, which I seeded and I took the membrane out, and about one and a half tablespoons of chopped cilantro. Okay, I'm just going to mix this and now I'm going to season it. I'm going to add two tablespoons of lime juice, okay, I'm going to season it with coarse salt and I'm going to add some black pepper to it. I'm also going to add about a teaspoon of crushed oregano. Okay, so mix that. So now we're gonna assemble the rest of our tostadas, okay? We're gonna go ahead and um, work on our, on our beef now. Um, and while the beef is, is cooking, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cut some iceberg lettuce. I'm gonna chop it, okay? I'm also gonna chop two to three tomatoes, probably just two, because we have our salsa here. I'm going to dice some avocado, okay? And then we will put our tostadas together. All right, so I'm gonna just go ahead and brown a pound of uh, ground beef. And then I'm gonna drain it, okay? okay? I'm gonna go ahead and season this with some coarse salt, some black pepper. And I'm just gonna let it brown, okay? So I'll see you in a few minutes. While the beef is cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and heat a 30 ounce can of refried beans. I'm gonna have it on low heat, but I want them to be ready when we're ready to assemble our tostadas, okay? So I'm gonna just put that aside and let it um, heat. Okay, this is cooked, so now I'm just gonna drain it. I'll go ahead and wipe my skillet. Add some olive oil. And I'm gonna add a small, yellow onion chop. I'm going to let this cook for a good six to eight minutes until the onion is softened and translucent. Okay, and it starts browning a little bit. So we'll let this do its thing and I'll be back. Okay, now I'm going to add two garlic cloves which I minced. Let us just cook for a couple minutes, okay? Now I'm going to add a small tomato, which I chop. Mix that. And I'm going to return the beef to my pan. Okay, I'm going to add about a tablespoon of cumin to this. About a tablespoon of dried oregano. And a quarter cup of water, just so a little water in there, okay? Season with salt and pepper again, okay? Just taste it and season it. And finally, I'm just going to add some chopped cilantro. I have about a tablespoon of chopped cilantro in here. Okay. I want you to let this cook for a maximum of five minutes, okay? It doesn't need to cook any longer. Okay, so let's plate our tostadas, okay? 
So the first thing we want to do is smear the bottom of our tostadas with some uh, refried beans, okay? Those have been warming up on the side here, so they're nice and warm. Now I'm going to top the beans with some of our beautiful beef here that we cooked. Okay. You know, if you wanted to just make this beef with, uh, with taco seasoning, go ahead. You know, I like to make it fresh like this, but you don't have to. You can go ahead and make it with taco seasoning if that's what you'd like. So now I'm going to go ahead and put some of our nice fresh salsa that we made here on top of that uh, meat. Now, this is a little spicy, so if you have kids eating this, you might want to omit this step, okay? I'm going to also put some chopped iceberg lettuce on here. Oh God, I can't wait to eat these. Little bit of chopped tomato. Naturally, these are a little messy to eat, as you can see. <laughs> we'll put a little bit of sour cream on top. And I'm gonna dice some avocado. I, I put a little bit of lime juice on this avocado so it wouldn't go um, brown on me. So that's, if you see any liquid, that's what you're seeing. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of diced avocado on each one. And you know, the, the way I do this is I put all these things on, uh, in bowls and I just let everybody make their own, okay? So a little bit of avocado. We'll put a little bit of cheese on them. This is four blended, you know, four blend Mexican, what is it? Four Mexican blend, four cheese Mexican blend, whatever. <laughs> and we'll garnish it with a little bit of freshly chopped cilantro. Look at that, yum. Here you have it, my friends ground beef tostadas from thefrugalchef.com. Make sure you come and visit us. We have all kinds of recipes that are not in video form. My friends, eat well without going broke, and I will see you soon.